Hi there. I'm here to get you some tarot messages for today. Let's look into the energies of your person. Let's we'll see what's going on with your person. What do these cards have to say today? We have a two of pentacle, six of wands, king of swords, five of cups, Nine of sword, five of sword, eight of sword, magician. All right, Ooh, got a few swords here. Interesting that you, what your person is most desiring here is nine of sword. So that's unusual. We're going to have to... Um, delve into that a little bit deeper here now why would someone want the nine of swords i'm thinking you know maybe they want to get over some sort of struggle here or get out of some sort of stuck situation or figure out how to successfully balance this situation uh get clarity on this uh this, this is a disappointment here hmm Let's pull one on this Nine of Sword energy here. Four of Sword. Yeah, okay. So that makes sense. Uh, what your person is most desiring is to heal from some sort of um, anxiety, some sort of struggle energy, maybe some sort of looping in their mind here. Maybe they've been in some sort of argument, whether they've been in an argument with you or... Or, you know, it's interesting because they're offering you five of swords and the action they're taking is eight of swords. So they're like in conflict. There's some sort of conflict here. Um, whether it's conflict in their own mind, uh, you know, because eight of sword, you know, eight of sword is that stuck card. But, you know, swords are all about thoughts. So, you know, we only really bind ourselves, you know, to... Um, you know, any kind of change here. Uh, in your person's thought space, though, we do have the King of Swords. So, like, there is clarity here. Um, let's pull one on that King of Sword energy. Two of Sword. Yeah, more swords here. Decision making here. Maybe your person is was, like, struggling with a decision here. Struggling in their mind here. Or struggling with someone else. Figuring out a way to escape the situation, make a change for the better here, bring in balance, uh, and find success here. Uh, I feel like I want to pull another on this Knight of Swords, Four of Swords. What is the battle here? What are they battling? Another person, their own mind? Oh, it's their own mind. Yeah, Hermit. Hermit is, you know, gosh, this, this person is in their head. Uh, for sure. Trying to find a solution to the struggle in their mind here. Hmm. Six of Swords. Yeah, more swords. Like, swords. The Six of Swords is, you know, moving towards smoother waters. They're trying to find the way forward here. Uh, manifest a new reality. Uh, bring in some emotional balance, some mental clarity here. Uh, they, they feel like they need to make different decisions or maybe they regret a decision they made or maybe they're not seeing something here. I'm looking at this, well, two of sword in the traditional decks sometimes are shown uh, really blindfolded, but this particular cat he's, he's covering his eyes. Same with the eight of sword. You know, eight of swords is like covering his eyes. Like maybe... Maybe a little bit of fear of, of making a change or, or stepping out of a comfort zone. Uh, but I feel like they're going to be able to make this change, figure it out, bring in harmony, move forward, find the successful solutions. Uh, let's, go, let's go for the Five of Sword here. Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles is contemplation. You know, okay, like what what am I doing here? Like what am I what are my goals? What are my wants? What are my needs? Um, you know, something's gotta give here. I'm get I'm getting like maybe 
a lot of things, maybe a lot of things in your person's world are like falling apart or something or, or not working out. Sometimes when things are not working out, it shows us that there's another option. There's something better. Um, it's time to move. It's time to, you know, take that leap of faith. It's time to take the blindfold off uh, and just go for it here. Make the change. Uh, escape that, the, the um, you know, that, that mental block. I feel like I feel like your person um, does a lot of waffling in their mind, like, should I, shouldn't I, should I, shouldn't I? Um, but the solutions, it comes from within here. Hermit. Hermit finds the solutions from within. You know, um, no one has all the answers, but I feel like the hermit um, has a goal, and they know instinctively how to get there. You know, the hermit is often shown in the dark with a lantern. It's like, okay, we may not see you know, the end of the path, uh, but we have this light here and we can take one step at a time. I feel like that's what that seven of pentacles is also saying, you know, like one, like just one thought at a time. Like, I feel like your person might be overwhelmed with thoughts. Um, you know, all right, how do I move forward? When do I move forward? Do I say something? Uh, how do I make this change? You have all the tools here. You know, so what Spirit most wants us to know here is this magician here. We have all the tools to make a new uh, a new start. Find that emotional fulfillment with the King of Cups energy here. You know, we've got five of cups in your person's heart space, how they're feeling. It's like they really want to make a change. They're, they're frustrated uh, in their, you know, in their current situation. And I feel like they want to make a change. They want to set new goals. They want to um, heal something, balance something. Uh, I feel, you know, with the, the cups here, it's it's an emotional thing, but it's also in their mind. Uh, three of, of um, wands here. It's like, all right, three of wands for me is like looking towards the future here, but we're setting goals. Like, what is the main goal here? I feel like maybe your person wandered aimlessly and, and didn't have a goal in mind or, or um, you know, they weren't sure what their goal was. So this, you know, these swords are about figuring, swords and the hermit here too. The hermit is like, okay, where, where the heck are we going here? Let's pull another on that hermit. See, we have it here twice. Four pentacles, yeah. Four, eight of sword, hermit, four pentacles. I feel like this is very much a uh, contemplation mode. Looks like she's um, is she, pr uh, look like she was praying. I don't know. Maybe she's only got one hand up, but you know, like trying to figure out like, okay, some sort of guidance. Um, you know, not that four of pentacles is like a praying card. Four of pentacles can be, well, four of pentacles can, you know, have a lot of different energies. Um, you know, but I'm feeling here, maybe trying to ground something, trying to manifest, trying to, uh, uh, follow through on their decisions or make sense of what's going on in their mind. Like a lot of, a lot of things going on in their mind, uh, in their heart, in their soul here with that hermit there twice. King of Wands. Yeah. Like what's, what's, um, what is going to make me feel prosperous? What is going to make me feel successful? What is going to be emotionally fulfilling? Uh, where should I put my energies, my talents? Uh, there's something here about setting a goal here. Let's put one on that six of wand. Nine of cups. Yeah, like where's my joy? What am I going to, what is going to make me happy? Because I feel like there's a lot of things going on in your person's world, like disappointments. Like there's like, feels like they've, they've gone through one disappointment after another. And it's like, okay, when is it going to be my turn? And I feel like there needs to be, um, you know, a clarity of mind and, or some sort of like, um, goal. Like, okay, this is what I want. This is what I see in my future. And I'm heading in that direction because anything is possible here right now. Yeah. The sun, it's like the universe has your back here. Uh, you're protected. Your person is, is protected here. Uh, this two of pentacles sun. It's like, things are going to work out. Things will balance out here. We got Hierophant on the bottom of this car, of this deck. Looks like there's another one that wants to show too. Um, to a sword again. Uh, and this one looks like it wants to show. Oh, we got another one here. Knight of Pentacle, 
four of wands here. Uh, I don't read reversals, but, you know, it's like, okay, am I making the right decision? Because maybe this person made some decisions in the past that didn't quite pan out. So they're, maybe they were hesitant on, you know, trying something new or, or deciding on a new direction, making a different decision. But I feel like they're, they're really, uh, with the hermit there twice, like focused on hermit twice, two of swords twice. Like they're really going deep to figure out what, what, what is, um, what's best for me? Like what, there's a decision being made here, um, and and they want to be very clear in their mind, body, and soul. Like, what is the goal here? They want to set a goal and go for it uh, and find that joy and happiness. Yeah, Ten of Wands, a little overwhelming because I feel like a lot of things are like, falling apart for your person like or, or just coming undone and sometimes when that happens it's the universe saying okay it's time to make a change uh, do something different that's uh, what I'm getting all right let's close this reading out with lover's oracle message what does the lover's oracle want to say we have reflection. Give each other some space at the moment. Yeah, it's like your person is figuring out how to transform this situation. Like they're deep. They're deep in their mind here. Um, deep in thought. Deep in the soul searching is what I'm getting. Um, we also have manifestation. Your dreams are set to become a reality. So it's like, yeah, your person wants to you know, the magician here, they have all the ability to manifest what they're wanting here. And this King of Cups is that emotional fulfillment. All right, let's cut it one more time and we'll call it a reading. Only love will set you free. Let go of the old and allow new love into your life. Peace be with you. Bye now.